There's no such thing as pure freedom in this world. Even the wind cannot blow on forever. You think I've got a sharp tongue? I just tell it like it is. If someone can't handle it, maybe that's their problem. There's no so, need to exchange yeah, pleasantries. It's rather pathetic to force a conversation just to occupy yeah. silence. All right. Today, our goal is to get all of these done. But first, follow me. to fix that a good boy i swear oh, i can never artie i love you but you need to stop doing that because 
there are daily quests that count towards... Achievements. All you have to do is the top one. Like... Wait, wait, repeat that. I skipped it. Water, then crushed leaves. Mix them well. Got it, got it, got it. Water, leaves, mix. How you doing, Tenta? I hope you're having a good day. Yeah, it's kind of warm today. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy that I got out of work early. You have vulnerability to pyro damage. Well, that sucks ass. Yeah, I was very surprised. I, like, texted my boss, like, yo, can I get out early? And he's like, yeah, you've been working overtime, so I finished everything I needed to. And instead of sitting around wasting, you know, money, I was like, I'm gonna go home, and I'm gonna play video games. This motherfucking bitch. This bounty isn't gonna be fun. <laughs> I guess I don't have any. <laughs> it's invulnerable. Immune to pyro, so Shangming is kind of useless here, so. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to use Perhaps we could take a walk by. Hi, Jama. Thank you for the daily How you doing, sweetheart? So there is also an achievement for failing a bounty. Oh, wait. That's a move. Shine down. Torn to oblivion. We 
two of you. I think I'd be able to beat them, but I did it. Five thousand fucking eggs, what the fuck, Artie? How do you have that many fucking eggs? Holy shit. Uh hey gay garlic bread. I know you have questions about um the US and stuff, but that is uh a territory that gets slightly political, so I said we keep that out of stream, please. Thank Hello you. There. Expedition oh my god. Why, Artie? You don't make them do fucking gold? You don't have any fried eggs. Bro. Take my eggs, bitch. Five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred and twenty. And I have all those quests, so I didn't read what it was immune to. Oopsies. What <laughs> to find out. I hope it's not animo. <laughs> What's good about Levelette is you know he's completely unbuilt. He still does a shit ton of damage. Vulnerability to electro damage. Fan fucking tastic.
Yes, fresh and floral, please, please, please. Okay, yes. <laughs> Beat the three bounties. Let's go. All right, um, probably keep this team. Wait, can I teleport, or does that... Not count. Oh, that's a fucking joke. You can't teleport?! Bullshittery! God. <sighs> I forgot how annoying some of these quests really were. This is where the Hydro Hypostasis is. That's how it's gonna be. I need to change my team. What is the situation? Gonna be epic. <laughs> Shine down.
God, I fucking hate this boss. So I, I don't think I needed to fight that for the quest. My soup was cold, and I went to drink it, and it was kind of gross. Don't care, lady.
So my goals for today for Artie's account is one, to get Inazuma reputation max by doing all the side quests I have. Farm some artifacts and level There's no up some characters. Thing as pure freedom. I have to wait two hours to lower the world level to see what's on. Quit following me. Huh. Quit following me. Marcy, what? Why are you so loud? Finally! Going to work? Have a good day at work. She, yeah, she's being a shithead right now. I have no idea why. I am streaming, by the way.
Bye, have a good day. Okay. I know I'm talking at chat. <laughs> If you're not really paying attention, these quests don't take long at all. Marcy, Marcy, come here, 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 come here. I hope you all got your daily dose of Marcy Grumbles. Perhaps we could take a walk by a... God, I hate these.
I would like to skip the most depressing fucking thing. Please. Yeah, you get a, a, a achievement for that. Marty, can you please be quiet? You've been screaming all day at me for absolutely no reason. Actually, don't care about you. Marcy, what is it? Marcy, come here. Why are you crying? Why are you screaming at me? Hmm? Why are we screaming? Why? Hmm? Oh, wow. You're a good boy. Where did that come from? There. Oh, has he just been attacking? Oh, this is so funny. I passed this scene like four times. Basically, he's been attacked by these fucking slimes this whole time. Marcy! Marcy, I'm gonna put you in baby jail. Fighting people and stop fighting the wires.
No Marcy. Yeah, this quest was weird, but kind of funny. She gets arrested for, like, selling fertilizer. Hang on, what's what's your reputation at now? Eight, you have fifty more. Okay, that's 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 fine. Okay, uh, Artie, can I do, can I do character story quests? Am I allowed to sit through those? Oh, you um... Take it. I have to go do Cloud Rotator's story quest to start.
No way you still have this floaty bloaty. Here we are. Right? Do you still remember the first time we came here and when we told her that Rex Lapis had been assassinated? She immediately so we probably don't need to bring any offers. Rex Lapis assassinated? Like the right into surgeon? That is Cloud Retainer, you absolute fucking buffoon. Yeah, you're right. All it takes. Okay, but if we're both friends, how can you make more. Ca <laughs> um. Hello. Mm. Um. Hi, man, is Tynan. And this is the Traveler. <laughs> Um, I'm just gonna let this auto play. Rex doesn't think we've met, but we're also friends of Cloud Retainer. May we have the pleasure of learning your name, Madam Modestus? You two... What is this tomfoolery? Has this shift in form so clouded your eyes that you no longer recognize one anymore? Wait. You're... Huh? You're the Illuminated Bird? <laughs> <laughs> You're the illuminated bird that I got two copies of? Though donning human form is scarcely any test of one's abilities. As for your confusion, one merely had no reason to indulge such inclinations before. I'm going to tell you wanted money. <laughs> You're indulging now. Well, one has made plans to pay a visit to some disciple. You? Worrying about keeping a low profile? You're the one who likes to pop up out of nowhere all over the place. In fact, Paimon can think of several examples. <clears throat> hey, didn't we agree not to bring that up at Oh, so you have taken care to follow the proper rules of etiquette after all. Most commendable. Um, One has never found oneself lacking in victory. <sighs> I'm going to skip dialogue. One plan to extend the invitation even if you had not raised the matter yourself. Shanha and Ganyu should be quite pleased to see you again. However, one would first inquire as to the reason behind your visit here. You have cause to seek one's company? Yeah, we can. If there are no urgent... Yeah, it's great! Ganyu has been quite busy with work as of late. One can count on one talent the number of times she returns to Mount Outsong each year. Shenhe has also secured employment recently. In her correspondence with me, she wrote that she shall have no need to return for the foreseeable future. Huh. Do they think one was so easily mollified? One shall investigate everything with one's own eyes. And decide for oneself if their living conditions are satisfactory. There's no need to exchange pleasantries. It's rather pathetic to force a conversation just to occupy silence. Okay, this is gonna take like six hours. I believe each story quest is about an hour or two long, so. Shocked to see Cloud. I guess he has no idea Shenhua and Ganyu have ever seen. 
to go. Why are you standing there, Cloud Retainer? Quietly now. One shall stay. Uh, but what? Hm. If one were to proudly proclaim one's presence, one does not wish to trouble her. Conversing vicariously via you two shall suffice. Do remember to inquire as to her recent well-being. Again, do not mention one's presence here. Fair enough. Makes sense. All right, then. We'll just pass on your regards and... Cloud Retainer? No. <laughs> oh. That's okay. Is that lady someone you know, Miss Danya? She is indeed. I'm sorry, Huixin. But... Oh, not to worry, Miss Danya. Thank you. Greetings. What brings you here today? And Cloud Retainer, too. It's been quite some time since I last saw you in this form. You are quite mistaken. One is not acquainted with this Cloud Retainer of whom you speak. One is simply a mere mortal passerby. Huh? Seeing she's not buying it. <clears throat> that was but a simple test. One did not expect you to be able to recognize one so easily, especially after so many years of only seeing one's other form. But recognizing you is, uh... My responsibility as your disciple. <laughs> An apt observation. One was simply passing by while attending to some important business. One thought it would only be fitting to pay you a visit while in the area. Wait, Paima wasn't aware of any important... Oh, uh... Cloud Retainer's right! We've still got cooking. Oh, is that so? Uh, one simply desired to see you. I understand. While one acknowledges the amount of work, ah, it still makes one nostalgic to see you as you are now, respected and independent. When you were young, you oft begged one to cuddle you to sleep when you suffered from nightmares. C Cloud Retainer, stop! Hmm. If you insist. We are running short on time regardless. So one will refrain from going into each and every story. Why don't you continue your conversation? One shall simply stand by and listen. Wow, you've been to so many new places since the last time we spoke. If you ever need anything, please just come find me at Yuehai Pavilion. Also, forgive me for my presumptuousness, Cloud Retainer. But if you plan to continue appearing in this form, don't you think it'd be helpful to adopt a human name? A human name? Huh. You raise a valid point. Considering the sheer extent of one's renown, Cloud Retainer is surely too recognizable as a name. You really think so? I, not that you're not famous or anything, but... You presume to know the extent of one's illustrious achievements. <laughs> one would hardly think such a thing to be possible. <sighs> Nevertheless... Can you? Uh, I assume that's a an adeptus of years past would... Oh, that sounds super... Actually, those lines were originally written to describe Cloud Retainer herself. Huh? Wait, so you're really that powerful? And what of it? Did you truly take one to be no not exactly? To be fair, Cloud Retainer rarely speaks of her past accomplishments. The tales of her past can only be found in ancient texts. It is said that once, a long, long time ago, there was a severe drought in Liyue. Left with no choice, 
Many people left their homes, while others spent day and night praying to the Adepti. Although I did not live through such tragedy, simply reading about it is enough to gain a visceral understanding of all the pain and desperation during that time. On top of the drought, a noxious gas also began to spread through the land. If not for Cloud Retainer's efforts, the books have this to say about upon arrival, the... That's incredible! Mortal records added... Even so, you stand... Oh, Paimon suddenly... Uh, how laughable. A name is but a simple label we carry with us on our journey through the world. Why would one be offended by such a trivial matter? <laughs> That's a relief. In that case, Paimon will continue to call you whatever feels right in the moment. Well, that is quite enough ancient history for now. Ganyu, have you had word from Shenhe? One has heard that she procured a job recently. Have you any thoughts on her workplace? And what, pray tell, of her monthly remuneration? Moreover, does she find herself overly inundated with work? Is she allowed time off during Lantern Rite? That is a lot of questions. Lol. There is no cause for concern, Cloud Retainer. I introduced Shenha to her employer personally. One in restaurant's business has been booming recently. So with Chef Mao being swamped with customers, and Shaoling still off and out in search of new recipes, I introduced Shenha to staff the restaurant. I see. Most excellent indeed. One has had the pleasure of being introduced to that family. Shaoling is kind and astute, while her father is loyal and reliable. One has no cause to believe that they will make Shenha's work difficult. <sighs> now, it is almost time to partake in the Vittles of Noon. One shall visit Wanmin Restaurant in person and see how Shenha is doing. Uh huh? But didn't you just say that you had something important to do? Uh, can that wait until after we've eaten? You may return to your work on you. One shall see to this matter on one's own. There will be many an occasion to dine together in the future. One is certain the opportunity shall present itself most readily. Of course, Cloud Retainer. Please take care. Traveler, Paimon, I'll see you some other time. See you around, aren't you? Oh, Paimon was pretty quick on the uptake there, don't you think? As soon as you mentioned important business to attend to, Paimon realized that you were just looking to cut the conversation short and not take too much of Ganyu's time. Is Paimon right? No. In fact, it was not an excuse. One <coughs> is visiting Liyue Harbor for an important purpose. Wait, for real? The moment is not yet upon us. Still, the truth will be revealed to you in time. Huh. She really seems to be playing up the whole mysterious Adeptus thing right now. Is it because we just heard that cool story about her powers? Ugh. Alright. I'm gonna go beat up some monsters and stuff, um, to get into that hopefully 90.
Very more. Too slow. I forgot that Liyue has some of the really pretty music that like you only hear like in one tiny area in the corner of the world that you never ever go to and it kind of sucks. Alright, so with this one, Novalette should be maxed out, which is great. 
um, we're then going to finish Cloud Retainer's story quest, and then we're going to go ahead, do our three weekly bosses, farm some artifacts, and then continue on with other story quests. I would like to get most of them done today. Yeah. Hm. The is back. I got to do more, okay. I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's just do this because we're here. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, how can I not? Not even fine food is enough to distract. Oh, I'm far more interested in you do it. No, no, no. What can I get for you today? Uh, greetings, miss. Uh, I was just wondering. <laughs> uh, what would you like to order? <laughs> uh, two servings of more... Welcome. It's been a while. You're welcome as this guest and greeted. Mm hmm. <sighs> and. Uh, this is. Master? Huh? Huh. One does not recall ever revealing this form to you before. I've trained and lived with Master for more than ten. <gasps> is something the matter, Matt? Hardly. Hardly. And check out the great. Indeed. <laughs> well, if it isn't the Traveler and Paimon, the lunch rush isn't in yet, Shenha. Go ahead. Sit down and. Thank you, Chef Mao. <laughs> Miss. All right. Back to this, we go really fast.
Oh my god, you are so fucking annoying. I fucking hate these things. Finally, he's maxed out. Oh my goodness. And we can go do this now. Um, already, do you want me to try to go for some weapons on the weapon banner? worth it because you have like no weapons. Here. 
I got a dream summon. I'm so happy. All right, I think our next boss is going to be Signora again for Raiden, and then we'll probably do. Uh, Scarabushi, Scarabush, Scarabush, Scarabush. Yo, what is up, Isa? Thank you, Lucky's. What's up? What's up? Doc tricks my fix my friend's account. <laughs> it's pretty bad. It's <laughs> pretty bad, man. It's pretty bad. Oh, that's not bad. I have no fucking dreams on. Of course. All right, one more boss fight for the week, and then we can continue all with the story quests that are all sitting. Arrived by 450, hell yeah. When I say it's bad, they have over a hundred fragile resin sitting. And their resin was maxed out at 600. Hmm. 
Heh, <laughs> 69 primos. Uh, what is your history on this matter? Let's see. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38. Pity, you have not wished on this matter in a bit. Okay. Alright, let's go beat up Senora super fast. And then I'll call it I'll call it quits for that on the week. Um and then we'll do Shenha the story quest. Bread is bread has entered my world. All right. I just noticed that cloud retainer is slightly floating. Which is pretty cool, actually, for her. <laughs> You're trembling. Is it the cold or just coward? <laughs> there is no escape. Let's go, bitch. I'm sorry I came to visit. Wow. Alright, you done being a bitch now? Can we kill you? Oh my god, what the fuck? Guys! I cannot believe I died. I never asked for redemption. Never. That is an HP percent, which I could potentially use on, um, 
Hey, 50, let's go. Perfect to remove sleep because sleep is good. Oh, that's so fair, though. to light. Alright, so now I just need... Alright, 7-7-7 seven, 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 it's pretty good for Novalet to start. She could be better, so it could scare me. Nice. All right, so she is 477. Obviously could be better. Scaramouche, you definitely want a triple crown. And Nova Led 777. Bennett's fine. All right, talents are decent for now. That's kind of what I wanted. Let's do four of the run for Nouvellet stuff. We'll do two Nouvellet, two Scaramouche.
Adventure time. Oh my god. There is no way I got that on the first run. On the first run? I'm a god! RNG on my side! What does the VIP Discord do? Uh, it, it allows you to basically access sub channels in the discord server they're not really active because i don't have a lot of subscribers but um you also get to suggest games to me and uh also i uh yeah that's that's pretty much it it's not really anything fancy yeah if i had more subs it would be i guess better i, I don't know What? Oh, dang, that's a dang Toro. Dang. All right, all right. Ba, ba, ba. Let me find you. I gotta find you. There you are. There you go. You're now pink. Yee, take you for the hot fit. Okay, it's it's not bad, okay? It's not bad. It's so much better than it what it was.
I mean, yeah, I, I, I used to give my subs monthly audios, but nobody really redeemed them, so I just kind of left it there. But if anybody still wants them, that's an option for monthly subs. Not VIP, though. You also get access to the self-promotion channel, as well as, um, you get a special role in the Discord. set oh shit did I oh thank fuck god <laughs> it one more time and then I'll be done. <laughs> Nouvellet is pretty good. None of those were decent. At least I got a decent, like, set for him. He's quite hard to build. Thank you. Thank you. 
Alright, it's not bad. Could be better. The world remains constant. Alright, um, I am gonna run a quick ad break because my food- I, I ordered some, some groceries, so I gotta go grab them downstairs and... I'll be back. All of you behave. All the world holds dear is by the backdrop of constant motion. I stand before it, alone and unchanging. What? Snackies. <laughs> Easy. Oh my god, I think they forgot the chips. I have to go check now. This is important, chat. Chips are very important. It's very bad. Inactivity serves no purpose whatsoever. Oh.
Rising to the water. Transitory. They forgot my potato chips! <laughs> Bro! I ordered chips! Where are my chips? All the world holds dear is but a backdrop of constant motion. I stand before it, alone and unchanging. I'm upset. How do I get my fucking chips, chat? It is just as one expected. The owner of Wanmin Restaurant is indeed a most reasonable and accommodating human. Still, the work here entails dealing with quite a varied oh, group of people. It's just not in the Has order. This has been difficult for you, Shenhe. It's been manageable so far. I sometimes run into strange people, but I have figured out a way to deal with them. Seems like you've been making progress. I'm upset now. So by dealing oh. with them, you mean... First, I try to talk sense into them. If that doesn't work, I threaten them with violence. At this point, they usually decide they are in favor of a civil conversation. I don't get it. It says I ordered chips, but there's no chips. Oh, I'm so confused. Oh, a sensible plan. One is glad to see you integrate so well into human society. And you, Master? How have you been? Simply marvelous. Though Mount Outsong has scarcely enjoyed your presence recently, one has hardly found the pleasure of one's own company to be lacking. I see. Oh, just as expected of Master. I'm very upset right now, chat. Gave me my I money back, but bit kind of upset because, like, Even I ordered work chips has and I wanted lately. chips. <laughs> I've already had a conversation with Chef Mao about taking some time off soon to visit Master. Oh, you did? <clears throat> Do make note of such matters in your letters in the future. There's hardly a need. Whoa, her mood shot up just like that. By the way, Master, since you are in Miyue Harbor, have you had the chance to visit? Uh, indeed. Is she. Ganyi told us the story of Clabbertina Dane. She's amazing. You never knew how powerful she was before. I see. In that case, allow me to also share a story about Master's past. I have oh. a reversed Ori. Ori. Is that a problem, Master? I believe this to be a good topic of conversation. No, not a problem. One was simply caught off guard. But no matter, please. Proceed. I have a reverse Oreo. I'm curious to see how much of one's own conversational prowess you possess. Master once participated in a race against Moon Car in response. Master agreed to forego flying in return for being able to use one of her devices in the race. Moon Carver accepted, only to find Master with a brand new device on the day of the contest. Huh. What kind it was a mechanical vehicle made out of iron. What was it called again? 
Huh. An electro-powered bicycle? Oh, you refer to the bicyclical Thunder Flash mobile. One spent 49 days conceptualizing and crafting it. It need only be infused with adeptal energy, and it can cover thousands. Oh, it boggles the muck. <sighs> Alas, the one flaw of my mechanism lay in its weakness against mountainous terrain. One was thwarted mere seconds from victory when it was thrown off course and failed to make it across the final stretch. Truly a most unfortunate turn of events. Anyway, do go on, Shenhe. Master, that was the end of that story. Is that so? Have you been lonely, Master? Lonely? Huh. At one's ictus, a most foreign sentiment. The mere mention of it is preposterous. Mm -hmm. hmm. What is the reason for that look upon your face? It's nothing. It's just... <laughs> well, Paimon gained a lot of respect for you after listening to that story of you summoning the rain and everything. But all it took was a few words out of your mouth, and it's like you're back to being that illuminated bird again. I'm just a little bit confused. Which one of the two is the real cloud retainer? To me, they are both master. One is the master that's widely revered by the people, while the other is the master that I respect and adore. Huh. One finds oneself exalted yet again. This is not to say that your words paint. She got, like, what? Two sentences of flattery from her disciples? Do you have any empty tables? Hey there, could we get another fish? I'm hearing more guests come in. I should get back to work. All right, good luck. Mm -hmm. One is fond of all the dishes here demonstrate no shortage of culinary skill. They're unique. Everything's so tasty. A bit too hot at times, but still super tasty. I'm sorry, miss, but our tables are... Shall we try somewhere else, Granny? But it smells so delicious. Well, you could always try... Okay. Uh... Oh. Me. Yeah, totally. Chip, they forgot you? my chips in my order. <laughs> I'm sitting so... here. I got one good artifact for Nivellet. What about you guys? Great. Thanks so much. My name is Shuyu, and this is my granny, Yuendai. Granny? Yep. Is there something? No, no. Behind my... <laughs> yeah. A lot of people compliment granny on her youthful looks. But she... <sighs> Granny, why don't you take a... Huh. Have we met before? No. Anticipated meeting, then. Please, take a seat. What would you like to eat, Granny? I want... Break... No, no, not this again. Granny, there's no break... Braised earthworms? Well, that sounds weird. Right, that's what Paimon was thinking. I... Need any help? Oh, thanks. That's nice of you to offer. Granny has pretty bad memory. Actually, her memory's been bad ever since I was... We died young. It's... Oh. Uh, but it's okay. Don't feel bad. Wow. <laughs> You're... And me? You're tough too, Granny. Yes. And it's hardly as if I forget everything. I still remember the important things. Uh... Ah, oh, I remember now. It was a dream. Huh? That sounds so... It was just a dream, so I forgot. Ah, oh, you know. Wait, so you have a reoccurring dream where someone's talking to you? That sounds spooky. Oh, does that mean you're possessed? Uh-huh. Does that mean you're possessed? <laughs> Unlikely. Her eyes are clear and her... Are you sure? Who do you take me for? Is one not? Ah, you're right. Paimon almost forgot you're the expert. Not anymore. <laughs> A younger fish is just getting weirder and weirder. What is going on here? As one said. Are you sure? Paimon's Paimon.
Serena. Just Shen Yun. Thank you all so much for offering to help. Oh, we don't need any payment for this. <laughs> but you're welcome. Um, but Miss Yin, all we have to go off is that. That is elementary. Since her dreams portray her younger self, then we shall retrace the steps of her youth. Hmm. Sounds like a plan. So, Granny. Why, of course I do. Okay. I. Once, when I was really little, my dad told me the Granny, if it's true, then. A martial arts heroine? Hmm. Oh! Ching Chong knows tons about Li Wei's ship. Are you leaving already? I'll go order some food, Granny. If it seems we must part ways for now. The Traveler and Paimon are bound for the Feiyun Karma's Guild, while you and I and Shuyu shall remain here and partake of their lunch. As for myself, I have matters... Straight word rambler? Precisely. Let... Alright. <clears throat> That reminds me. Oh god, fucking partisan. Ching <laughs> Cho, come here, sir. Pinpoint her identity from your description. Nameless head. That's right. Then all they knew was that she, after the drought and the way this nameless heroine faded from fame into obscurity later in life, is not too dissimilar from Miss Yuendai. Thanks a lot, Ching. It's nothing at all. Well, Paimon still thinks that. Th Let me think. It's you. the real life heroine who ins. <laughs> it's rare for a chivalry. I've never understood. We'll be sure to tell you if we make it. That's a deal. Paimon feels like we just learned. Oh, right. There's a drought in this story, too! Well, they used to be. So while droughts do happen, the crops wither. That sounds up. Yeah. No, Still, I do not care. I really don't. Back in those it. days, disasters were both more severe. Do you have any other... We're good for now. We're just going to head back and meet up with Miss Yen. I'm on hope sick. Anyway, we'll be off now. See you some other time. It's no problem at all. Thank you. Swarm Fury. Close enough? I have recorded the tune that you requested. I hope it will be of help to you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Straight word for... Oh, it's no serious matter. I was just reminiscing about the last time I saw you in this form. Time has wrought such a Time has little bearing on one's existence. Oh, why so poor? Well, approximately how much more would one need? Hmm, it does not require. Fabricator, Madam King! <clears throat> Nothing save for some trivial matters. Shinto has a dear. Do not be troubled, young. Uh, what do you think, Shuyu? Does it match up with what you... Hmm. According to the story, the nameless heroine eventually fell in love with an exorcist from that... I don't have many memories of him, but there was this one time I found a box in her attic full of a... I think so, too. Granny might remember something when she's returned to a familiar place. What marvelous tea. It's as if I was taking a stroll in the... Is that so? Then please drink it. Thank you. Okay, sure thing. Um, I have a secret I want to tell you. <laughs> What's wrong? Well, I've been kind of... Oh! Uh, about that. Mm, well, you guys just... Uh, must have been a 
a slip of the tongue. <laughs> One is indeed in. <laughs> I knew it. Well, one time when I was a little kid, I had this super high fever, and Granny wasn't around. She put me on her back and flew me to her cool adeptus house and fed me some sort of magic potion. I really wanted to thank her, so I just kind of, uh, pure white a little. Have you ever met one that's. Hmm. Never has one met an adeptus with such. That's weird. Well, even if it was just in my head, it doesn't. Leave it to us! Let's go to lunch! Okay. <laughs> I forgot how long some of the long story quests are, Jesus. Wang Shu In. Wang Shu In. Do you remember this place, Granny? Yes. The fish here is... I believe I used to have a room. I'll come with. Paimon's still having some trouble understanding what she's talking about, but... Luke! Jeff! What are you doing here all of a sudden? You scared the living daylights out of Paimon! <laughs> I sensed a non-human presence and decided to come take a look. If you're here, then there's likely no trouble afoot. I suppose there's no cause for concern. It's been a while, Cloud Retainer. I see you have returned to your previous form. I love how Zhao knows it's, 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 it's her. I have indeed. I fought alongside her in this form on many occasions during the Archon War. Oh, wow! What was she like during the war? Oh, wait, let Paimon take a guess. Was it anything like this? Behold, the glory of one's newest invention, the Bang Bang Continuous Fire Mechanism! <laughs> open surrender, or... An impressive imitation. <laughs> I'm a new... Even so, Cloud Retainer was not always as austin to... The Archon War reached its peak after Guizhong's death. The Cloud Retainer who fought beside me in those devastating battles was taciturn and solemn. A Cloud Retainer who barely talks? Once one had bid farewell to the one dwelling between mountain and fort. After the war, Cloud Retainer retired to Mount A Although I do believe- it One believes there is little need to relive bygone matters. Granny, are you okay? Uh, back then, at this place, I- Perhaps this conversation should end here. I shall take my leave now. Should you encounter any trouble, you need only call my name. Love you, Zhao. My Everyone, husband. I, I think Granny is finally beginning to- Slowly now. A long time ago. Huh. So what she- I don't remember. I, I was confined to my room in Wangshu Inn, where I spent many days unconscious. I'd come to every once in a while and stare at the migrating birds outside the window. It was a solemn sight. I remember crying, but I'm not even sure I knew why. One day, I met a traveling merchant. Upon hearing of my illness, he sold me a bottle of soul-revitalizing tea pills. He told me that the pills were concocted using adepti blood and could be used to alleviate my symptoms. And sure enough, I made a full recovery. My illness remained dormant for several decades after that. Wait, but if your illness remained dormant and it was all thanks to the pills that you managed to keep the sim- I'm sorry, I don't- Hey, you're not useless. Oh, fret not, dear child. The recovery of a person's memories is a gradual pro- Next location. There isn't really a landmark here. After all, if she was there for any length of time, then she... Oh, right.
can't t double check this book. Not the best, but it'll do. Still, I was thinking. Huh? I'm not sure. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> Paimon sees an abandoned house. Why don't we take a break over there? This place. Do you remember something, Granny? I... I remember. It was a moonless night. I had been injured, so your grandpa was supporting me. We fled together with some being in the fog behind us in hot pursuit. I had exhausted my strength. I remember that night. I alone am the source of this sin. But sin? I don't know. I don't remember. Eventually, the house was filled with the sound of my baby's first cries. My dad? He was my pride and joy. And so I are you, Shuyu. Hello, you're what's so up? Much what's like up? Him, but you're always going to be different from me. I. I don't care what you might have. You're too sweet, Shu. All right. Let's not stand. If one recalls correctly, the next place should be Chin. God, honestly, this I I really missed the shorter story quest. Now, <laughs> like I don't. I see a viewpoint. I think it's almost done. remember everything I still felt a sense of but here I don't have that feeling uh, perhaps I did come here in the past but it just didn't but did the stories get it wrong then yeah that's true but there are also the I'm almost hoping this place would jump I'm sorry to disappoint you too it's all right we're not going to give up yet thank you huh that way What's that mountain? Oh, let Paimon look! Huh? Isn't that Mount Outsong? Looks like we've come full- Mount Outsong. Mount Outsong. Granny, are you okay? Don't push yourself, Granny. It's okay if you can't remember- Mount Outsong, I- <gasps> Mount Outsong holds some familiarity to you? It does, but I- Are you feeling- My head- Yun, is there anything you can do? Let us go to Mount Outsong. But... Fret not. All will be well. You may leave the rest to me. I pre- Wait, really? <laughs> I never...
I, I, uh, this, this thing does make me cry. This, this, this story quest is gonna make me cry, I know. This is it. Uh, ha, ha, ha. I don't know your name. Hi. What's up? What's up? Hus, Hus. I'm gonna call you Hus. Hus. Precisely. I don't know. I'm sorry. A recent one at that. I am most pleased with the result. What is up? What up? Suspense Somnium mechanism. It periodically yeah, releases what's up? What's a soft up? breeze, How's it going? which when paired with a gentle adeptal tune, can help the listener subconsciously relax, and even enter a semi-hypnotic state. Soothing agitation and anxiety, relieving exhaustion and insomnia, its potential uses are numerous indeed. Oh, what a cool we could have come to Mount Absong right off the bat and sing- How preposterous. Had you we adepti can only help those who first resolve to help themselves. Had Primer thinks she could as previously mentioned, a gentle adeptal tune is required to take full advantage of the mechanism. Oh, Primon can feel and you, you and I. <sighs> it appears she has already succumbed to the depths of The drought is over, but why do you look like you want to cry? The potion. It's nearly run its course. I've never regretted meeting you. Not even for a second. Please. Please, no. Have you forgotten? This is the world you left behind. One of gentle breeze and morning dew. Perfectly straddled betwixt the realms of heaven and earth. This is your home. This is where you belong. You should have never left. The you. I felt so bad. This story quest made me uh, cry. So that is the truth. No wonder this place is so familiar. Granny! Granny, are you okay? Cloud Retainer. Hmm. Your memories have returned. Wait, did you just call her? You already knew each other? Yes. Granny, please don't cry. Oh, don't worry, my... I'm so sorry. It's all come back to me now. <sighs> One can sense the guilt that now plagues your conscience. No, it's okay. I assure you. Please, Granny. I know, dear child. Tiny child, I do not care. Your voice is... I am, in truth, not a human being. I spent many, many years living on Mount Outsong, bathing in the sun. Though she never took me on as a formal disciple, I, all, I even contemplated completing my training and becoming an adeptus in my own right. I followed her teaching. Fifty years ago? That's right. Master regaled me with many. She was the one I looked up to the most. But I was still far from being a real adeptus. I possessed no ability to take on human. She warned me that the potion's effects would only last ten years. And if... Oh, no... So that was... it was because... Indeed, I fell in love. Of Though course, I, I forgot she falls in love. Entire life training <laughs> in Mount Tianhang. When we met, it was not only... Although clumsy and impulsive as he was, you'd think he was the real strange bird among the two of us. But still, just like me, he cared deeply. I could not help but fall for him. But my time continued to... Oh, no. 
What happened? I committed an offense. I wanted to stay with him, even if it meant living a life full of pain. I knew I had betrayed Master's hopes, but I was too ashamed to face her. I was convinced that she would not support my decision, and I lacked, but that was only the beginning of my troubles. I began to suffer from us, along with my memories as a crane. I looking back. Emotional damage. Yeah, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> Emotional damage. It was such a fortunate coincidence that we were there at the same time. If it weren't for those soul revitalizing tea pills, I probably would have. <sighs> Granny! Coincidence? Why did it master? <sighs> Human custom would dictate the conferral of gifts to be an order. <sighs> So when I tried to conceal my... One still remembers when you were but a fledgling. You possessed us. One found you with such ease every time. Oh, wait, wait, wait! My mom's here! So, closet cleaner, you've been... <sighs> Perhaps... One was furious upon receiving your letter. Seized with anger, one set out to bring you to your senses. In truth, one but soon. One came to appreciate the devil unwilling to begrudge some wishing to grant you a life without regrets. One gathered many divine ingredients. That's why I'm For real. That's so true. After much um, I'm actually helping my friend and viewer uh, fix up their account. So clearing everything out, essentially, like all the quests. Um and leveling up their characters and building their characters for them. One took great care to alter one's features. And as one expected, you were... <sighs> one was quite torn. Should one... Nevertheless, one would speak to you about another matter, if you are amenable. Even considering your loss of memory, one was simply flabbergasted that you could so easily forget the consequences of consuming medicine infused with a depth of blood. The proclivity to attract monsters is hardly that complicated of a concept to remember. To think that you tried to travel while weak from sickness and heavy with child. Had one not intervened to clear the fog, all of you would have been lost in the night. Make way for the Adeptus! A bad character. I actually have her. I lost. I, I randomly was given her on my account twice. Those monsters would hardly have pursued you with such. Said godly room. One was, after all, an active participant in the. In the end, one to see you happy. Marcy, it's not dinner time, and you know it. Stop meowing your head off. Now you should have a complete understanding of the events. Wait, but if that's true, then the prey who took care of me when I was sick must also be. Ah, one had almost neglected to recount the absurdities of that tale. Just as Yuan died troubled one with her antics, 
So did you give one many a headache? <laughs> Upon finding you burning with fever, one made plans to bring you back to one's abode for treatment. However, when one asked you why, <laughs> apparently you believed that one could not possibly be one had no choice but to apply powder to one's body to conceal the variegated nature of one's appearance. It bears mentioning, however, that as a crane, you and I was perhaps fate. <laughs> All right, are we done? Now, oh, one has always viewed still, one could not reveal your identity right away. Had one simp memories are most meaningful when recall. Master, I, I must ask. If one has never regarded you when it is time for one's progeny to tis a refuge refer hmm. one speaks of course of a place not unlike one thank hmm. one expects you to have said 40 years ago you chose a path without a future <sighs> even the power of an adeptus has its limits fortunately you were able to avoid that scenario by reclaiming your so one will help her reclaim her original form she's gotta go back to being I a master you Hi, already yeah, thank you more than enough for me i don't know how i could possibly <sighs> you granny please don't leave us. don't be sad dear child granny has led don't forget to eat well okay i promise good girl good girl don't worry I won't stop until I can turn into a human without having. That's a good girl. Even. I'll eat well, Granny. I promise. And I'll live. That's a good girl. I'm so sorry, Master. Sadged. <laughs> she you let her be. Tears are a necessary part of maturation. Now that the issue has been resolved, you ah, I'm going to cry. This cutscene kills me every single time. the sad vibe no don't you dare would be behind me I'm like crying No, you don't get the ruin it. Uh. 
A nightmare? Curious. If you relaxed, shouldn't your dreams be pleasant? It was a good dream. It's just... You weren't ready to wake up. I always feel so bad for the twins. Eloquent as one may be, words of comfort are not one's strong suit. You are doing all you can. One can see your strength of will, your fearlessness in the face of danger. And so, whatever your dream may be, one believes that you shall achieve it. Of course, whenever the perils you face overwhelm you, or you become weary, one is always here for you. After all, <laughs> as an elder, it is only right to look out for the young ones. <laughs> I'm sad. That cutscene kills me every time I see it. Madam, oh, sure you, you're awake. How do you feel? I, I feel, Madam, uh, oh, and I know Granny thought what she did, but even though Granny lost her memory, I could become a cool adeptus like you. And upon some reflection, one supposes you are no me. Thank you so much. I, sure you, Chiron's gonna let you in on a little secret. If you join them, you'll never enjoy one min restaurant's delicious cooking ever again. <sighs> How utterly pro Every individual must find their own path to- Well, you say that, but Paimon's not seeing any tasty treats. Although Mount Altsong is rich in nat- That is precisely why one plans to relocate- Oh, you're leaving Mount Altsong? One has never concerned oneself with the location. Yet in the end, all of one's disciples ended up in Liyue Harbor. One has reflected on this fact for many years now. One can one is most curious as to what aspect of Liyue. Why are you all so silent? Paimon is. Uh... <laughs> one has prep. One will be assuming the identity of a human while residing in Liyue. Don't worry, we'll help you. So, uh, when can. Perhaps in two days' time. One has some matters to s one has already picked out a handsome property near Chihu Rock. Tip top. Oh, you really can. How about we meet? A sensible plan. Oh, also, why don't you take this to s Awesome! Thank no, I don't want to cry anymore. Is there a Shinto that we tell him what we found out? <laughs> God, I hate winning. I cry. Should we make a trip to the Feiyun Conference Guild? It's totally up to you. Huh. You- uh, In what way- I have to be careful. Where's your cloak? Uh, Miss Chan- Ah, perfect timing. This is- I'll have you- Several- uh, Indeed. <clears throat> they're- they're- Yup, yup, they- Hear that? <laughs> Doubt their authenticity any further. Whoa, 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 please don't go! I apologize. An expert, you say? Oh, very well. I will wait for a little while longer then. Traveler? Master! Oh, it's you two again. Chiyu! Is that a new- Mm-hmm. Master- Huh? You know how to- Ooh. Do I know how to- m Master, I brought in most of my stuff. There's a- Fret not. I shall help you move them into your room. Uh, actually, I, I should probably- uh... <laughs> It appears my young- now, this expert you mentioned. Soon, soon. Here, allow me to make some introductions. Hey, I forgot he's here! Mr. Zhongli, 
a well-respected consultant at Wangshong Funeral Parlor, and an expert in all manner of valuables and antiques. Mr. Zhang Li, this is Miss Shen Yun. She uh <laughs> they both know it's each other, and they're so awkward about it. Ah, if it isn't Miss Shen Yun, it has been qu oh, in, in quite well, thank you. I was fortunate enough over the past few days to enjoy both a stroll. Huh, uh, so you indeed. How fortunate we are that fate has brought us. <laughs> you are too kind, Mr. Zhang Li. True collectors pride themselves on their wealth of knowledge and eye for detail. I can say without a doubt... Why, you flatter me. <laughs> Not at all. Um, while I am loath to... You two already knew each other, and you... Ha! A preposterous accusation! Miss Shenyun speaks the truth. Contracts are built on honesty and trust. If that proves to be beyond your capabilities in this instance... Zhongli invented literally, 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 but, like, I still want Zhongli and Novelette to, like, interact with each other. Every time they've had it, Novelette has run away. I can't, I can't! What fool would... I deeply apologize for doubting you. So... There is no cause for concern. They are indeed rare and precious valuables. Take this. The same can be said for this. I am sure you have heard from your travels that the study of mechanism. Oh, Literally! <laughs> Since I hired you as my consultant, Mr. Zhongli, I shall, of course, trust your good opinion. Then, in that case, Miss Shenyun, I'll take the lie. Yeah. The Northland Bank. <laughs> I fear. Friends, have you been? We've been great. How about you? My days have been quite pleasant as well. I as for you, Miss Shen. I must say, the name Shen Yun sounds. Whatever for? Am I not addressing you as a friend should? Well, that is true, but <sighs> alas, refer to me however you will. After. <laughs> It would seem that you have gained many valuable insights over the years, Cloud Retainer. One has indeed. One's previous days were all brief. Now that one has this city... Not unlike the ocean tides, so too shall the movement of people ebb and... Alright, that's enough reflection for one day. No need you make a valid point, Paimon. Now that the sale has concluded... Hmm? Perhaps you have forgotten, Cloud Retainer. But I once tried my hand at that dish. You were- Oh? It was a reunion between friends several centuries ago. Alas, you must have been too preoccupied. Huh, hardly. T'was most certainly out of consider- It is settled then. Bamboo sh- One has already passed word to Shen Hun Ganyu to make a- <laughs> It should be a- Shu Yu, come now, it is time to dine. Ah, this gentleman over here is Mr. Zhang Li. A humble employee of Wang Chung Funeral. Nice to meet you too, he, Mr. Zhang Li. God who, you know, decided to kill himself, but not kill himself. That's a better introduction. That should be everyone, right? Sounds good. Actually, Master, have you ever tried Adeptus' Temptation? I heard it's impossible to stop eating after eat- Hmm, that sounds rather imp- Make his own death, yes. <laughs> freedom, freedom! And it's done! To an hour and 45 minutes later. One story quest done. I want to die if it isn't so many. Artie, I hate you. Why do you have so many? Think I've got a sharp <laughs> or to die, okay? There's too many of them. <laughs> There's so many.
Damn it, I thought it would work. If you have time when I'm not on the account, it would be really nice if you could do some of that. Well, we made it. Quick, take out the dragon scale. Wait, wait. No, see, kind of the I'm gonna finish up Simulanka for you today. as you have eight days to finish it. Yeah, no worries. It's only five o'clock. I've got about four more hours in me. Getting ready to fight, aren't we? I feel more comfortable in my regular outfit. Cacti also put away that sword around his waist. Ah, uh, should have never had the useless. Hmm. Do you need to do anything to prepare, Traveler? Let me in! Oh, thank God I get trial characters. Bet this is what Watch out in front. It's coming. No! No! Damn it! Stop it! 
<laughs> with your homing fucking missiles. I fucking hated playing this the first time. Look, he's here. Ah, another. But are you? Of course. I just don't like. Then you need only. I feel so bad for the dragon, because, like, no, he's. Ah, uh, bad stories. Same thing just now. Well, we definitely saw a different side. This world might be a lot the next time we encounter the dragon. That sounds like a good plan. I'm sorry. If the world. Ah, uh, just keep walking.
radish. Yes, 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 he did. Come, guys. We're getting too far away. <sighs> He's just up ahead. Is he trying to lure us somewhere? I'd say we were the ones who backed him into a fight. He was just gonna... He's had year after year of people coming here to try to take his head. If you ask me, his reaction is perfectly normal. But maybe there's still something we can... I wouldn't count on it. Maybe prepare for a final battle. I love how he's like, you really want to get beat up that bad? Yes, yes you are. Oh, he absolutely does. I gotta be graded. Ah, ah, ah. Yo, what is up, Raiders? I'm in the middle of big boss fight. What is up? What is up, Cerberus? Thank you so much for the raid, Raiders. If you need to raid and run, that is totally understandable. Please take care of yourselves. Make sure to hydrate. Do you gotta do post-stream? Cerberus, if you have time, how was your stream? Let me know how it went. If you need to raid and run, that is totally understandable. Please take care of yourself. I ran out of stamina. I hope you had an amazing stream, though. Thank you so much for the raid. I don't like a button chemicals. Oh, my God, what the fuck, double raid? Where's the bomb? Was, oh, your camera broke just so though when it's out there. That's fair. Oh my god, this is so loud in my ears. Hang on. What is up, Vice? Thank you so much for the raid. Hi, you raided me. Oh my god. 
Uh, Cerberus, thank you again. I hope that Subnautica is awesome for the rest of it. I have not played through it, but I've watched so many challenge runs. It's like one of my favorite games to watch challenge runs for. Vice, welcome in. Welcome in, Raiders. My name is Rander Falls. I'm an ancient based storyteller, Beat Super. And today, I am playing Genshin Impact and fixing my friend's account. It is... It is... It is bad. Right now, we're doing an event. Raiders, if you need to raid and run, that is totally understandable. Please take care of yourselves. Do what you gotta do. Post-stream care is extremely important. Orpheus, thank you so much for the follow, sweetheart. Bam, bam, bam. Vice, uh, if you want to tell me a little bit about your stream and how it went, thank you so much. Make sure you take care of yourselves though post stream. And uh, yeah, if you got uh, if you got a random run, that was totally understandable. I see some. Are you sure you want to create this child? <gasps> he will be abandoned by his creator, and eventually. Oh, it was good I playing know. Persona 3 Reload. Yeah, yeah, that's awesome. That sad story with the disappointing ending. It's what happened in the real world, isn't it? <laughs> That's exactly why I want to change things. In a different way. I understand, Arthur. But no, if you give him that... But there's still a chance, right? Maybe it's a shot in the dark, but... I've never played any other Persona games, try. but they look pretty fun. He deserves a better... Although, if things all right, Mike, since you're so far, it's your first Persona game. Yo, how is it for you? Do you like it? Also, there is unfortunately an ad break coming up. So, if you're not subscribed, you could use your Prime Gaming, or you could use Twitch Turbo, or you could subscribe if you don't like the ads. Mom, I'm sorry. Unlike my friends, I don't have a lot. It's okay. It's yeah, no worries, okay. Vice. You have a great rest of your evening. Once Thank I'm you for gone, raiding in. I will become a star in Simi Lanka and watch over you from above. Go forth and re you'll meet good friends one day. I'm sure that as for this world. <sighs> so in the end. So you're hated by people too. Damn. <laughs> so that's it. That's really your. Yeah, wish. the hex. The witches are to from the hex and circle. Correct. Right yes. I'm going to dismiss this ad because cutscene. Or deny the true feelings of your heart. Now remember your name. Durin. And of course, we go running after them. He is definitely an empath.
Okay, God, chat, my controller is having a stroke. Game! Not magnifier. RCPs. I heard people saying you found to fight the dragon, so I followed you here. Wait, didn't someone else fall through just- Oh yeah, that guy. He called the dragon something- Durin. That's his name. Oh, hi Kai. You're okay? He's fine. Fine. Oh, wait, that's the name of the dragon from Dragon- uh, Right! It was- <sighs> So, what exactly happened down there? You've been acting weird ever since- So that's the truth about Cinderella. I still haven't named my wanderer other than Wanderer. <laughs> weren't hallucinations. Huh. I thought it was the people we met along the way are probably workers from the Toitania mines. When I first came to this world, a voice ah. Who is Come with me. The answer All right, chat. Uh the ads probably going to run, so give me a minute. I need to turn the AC on. It's kind of hot in here. I'll be right back. Capacity heat is directed, so y'all behave now. I'm gonna go ahead and run that ad. Being a grumpy. Okay. Is this? That's right. The Bells are they? Or more precisely, M. Action circle. Sorry, time on shift. She created the story of Durin. Well, the Simulanka version, at least. These records should cover most of what you want to know, including the identities of the other two god- By all rights, I should have been a spell. Her hmm. Barbie love- I think oh, a parrot- 
My dear sister, the time we pay said if you wept. It's Simulanka Duran, and he's looking up at something. Star, this must have been after and this looks like maybe the toy Yeah. Now that you mention where's the presence? Look at the size of those footprints. If that's every time he lands, then no wonder people are so terrified of him. So that's why you took the stars. Because you missed your mom. I feel so bad for him, and the music just makes it so sim like so sweet, honestly. It's a different goddess. This. Oh, it's all right now, Durin. Nobody here wants to hurt you. Don't say that, Durin. So that's why you made that wish. <sighs> so stupid. <laughs> oh, he goes, Aww. You guys can see that all you want to do is get along with everyone. Hulk. Oh, give me you just want to make friends, people to play with, to talk to, people who accept you, or at least accept your apology. hurt anyone heck the idea never even crossed your mind sure you scared a bunch of people half to death but that's only because they had no idea what kind of dragon you really are yeah if you had a heart to heart with them i'm sure they'd come to understand you and see your point of view Is it your true wish to live? Then close your eyes and make a wish. Just trust me. I, Neely, the forest fairy, give to you my blessing and welcome you as a dweller of the forest. Wait. May everyone accept you as one of our own. And may the Forest of Blessings be a place you can call home. I, Navia, King of Constellation Metropole, give you my blessing. I grant you citizenship to my kingdom. Oh, me too! As the, uh, Nekomata in Boots of this world, I give you my blessing too. Wait, what's going on? What is up, Tiger Wolf? I can't. This scene, this scene made me cry the first time I saw it. I was sobbing as I did this on my own. I, the hero of this world, give you my blessing. I recognize you as a resident of Simulanka. May you find acceptance in this world. Also, speaking as someone who'd like to be your friend, I wish you all the best for the future. <laughs> you say? Wanderer! I, a traveler who has traversed many worlds, give to you my <laughs> blessing. May you find friendship and goodwill no matter where you go. Lumi speaks! Lumi speaks! She speaks! <laughs> Mom. As for this world, I leave it to you. Huh? 
what? Why are you all staring at me? Look how cute he is. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. My claws and my wings and oh, my tail. <gasps> Does this mean? <laughs> wow, you look so cute. Quite a radical Marcy, transformation. stop it. I will put you back in baby jail. Nope. Uh, not that there was anything wrong with the way you looked before, of course. How do you feel? Are you happy with your new appearance? Does anyone have a flower with them? Oh, oh I do actually. Here you go. They're, they're not changing. I can touch things. Hey, hey, that's great. Now the residents of Simulanka won't be scared of you anymore. But what about all the things that I did before? I swear to God, if he doesn't get any sort of redemption arc. Hi. Hi, Goblin. Hello, Goblin. Can I help you, Goblin? Hi, Vivi. <laughs> yes, you are a good girl. Yes, you are. Goblin. But I can't let you go because then you go attack... Vitaro! Oh. Bonk. I will bonk you. Ah. That's simple. Just go out there and atone. You could fill in the footprints you left on the ground. Or help the people around the broken sea get home. Okay. And you'll come along and help me, right, that guy? Huh? Why would I do that? Uh... Because you said you wanted to be my friend. You little... Ugh. Well, maybe I spoke too soon. Huh? But I thought... It is... I'm crying over... I'm crying over the redemption arc. <laughs> Look at the faces they're making. All right, fine. I'll go with you. No, good yeah, cries, really good cries. It's it's so sweet. The redemption no arc is so anyway. sweet. Oh, thank you. You're the first friend. Bob Scarla coming in correct, correct. Let's go back up. I'm about to suffocate down here. Oh, it feels so good to finally see Hat Guy meet his match. <laughs> yeah, okay. Pirate just never thought yeah. we'd see the day, that's all. <laughs> it's a character right. who's Let's had head back up a then. lot of character development in the last two years, and I really like seeing him have more development. Oh, don't be scared, Durin. We'll be right by your side. Mm hmm. Thank you for your blood. Ta-da! Surprise, everyone! Ah, a talking street lamp! <laughs> street lamp? Oh my! You mean you still don't remember me? Uh, I know that voice! It's Mom's friend! Hello there, traveler and friends! And Durin, it's good to see you. You've changed quite a lot. In fact, you look so different that perhaps... I should call you Mini Durin. <laughs> yes, Alice is back. Mini Durin, huh? Marcy, yeah, can you please? I like the sound of that. It's nice being smaller. <laughs> Anyone a cat expert you here? One of the three goddesses of this world. Are you the goddess of creation? Any cat experts know why my cat is screaming at me for the last, I don't know, 24 hours? <sighs> yep, that's right. But although it's the most if you've ever read any of M's stories, you'll know just how enchanting the worlds are that she writes about. So enchanting that I just had to step inside and explore it for real. So I got B involved and with M's consent created the world of Simulanka. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're getting a little ahead of yourself. 
<laughs> Don't worry. Hmm. Let's start with your first question then. I'm here because I sensed a great magic power emanating from the book just now, and I couldn't resist the urge to peek inside and check it out. That must have been when we all gave Minnie Durin our blessings, right? Yes, exactly. It's all thanks to your magic that Minnie Durin was able to take this form. Come say hi to me, little one. No, oh, because anytime I try to give her affection, she button. bites me and then slaps me. So I don't really know what she wants. Look at this shit head. Oi. Come here. Come here. Come here. She just bit me and slapped me and, and walked away. That is that is how this goes. <laughs> so what about us? Was it all the plan isn't the when Durin of Simulanka made his wish to the goddess of fate, it just so happened that in a world far away, all of you wonderful people were holding a copy oh, no, of M's stripped. fairy Help. tale Help. at that exact Help. moment. And because of your noble and kind souls, you were selected by the goddess of fate to come and save this world. Now that you mention it, that's what I was doing when I was transported here. I was reading a fairy tale to some children in the Fluxandra. I think I just, uh, happened upon an old book and decided to use it as my pillow during a nap in a box. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a crazy coincidence. Oh, that's not right. How come everyone else got a time to roll except us? Yeah, that was it. We just received a strange... Oh, is that what happened? <laughs> hmm, good question. Oh, Why plus. indeed? Maybe I thought this was such a good story, it simply had to be read by someone. As the traveler and witness of many worlds, how could I let such a beautiful place pass you by? I can sense that your blessing for Minnie Durin was a very special one. With this blessing from beyond the story, he might even be able to explore worlds outside of this one. To that, you mean? That's right. In fact, the every story has an ending. So, in other words, Predestined lives these people lead were always going to disappear one way or another. Wait, so even if the people here get to go to other worlds, surely there's gotta be a way we can leave too, right? Can I help you? Marcy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you realize? Huh? You can either take the boat at the Broken Sea or touch the giant bookmark at the cliff. How were we to... Huh, didn't I? As for your other friends who were summoned here, if I had to guess... I'd say the goddess of fate probably didn't tell them about it because she wanted them to get engrossed in the story. She's M's reflection after all. It wouldn't su Anyway, I think that I... I'm gonna go... Mm. Now we know. Same here. It's not ever... <laughs> I'm glad to hear... By the way, Mini Durin. Uh, now, before I depart, please let me... Goodbye. Guess this is where the hero's journey... Ah, but it's also where a new journey begins. Huh? You bet. For starters, hmm? Huh? Ah, uh, stop looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> I already said I'll come <laughs> with you. Whoa! Look over there! Wow. The stars are beautiful. I'll bet that's a gift to Minnie Durin from the three goddesses of this world. Oh, thank you, Mom. There we have it. That's the main event quest. There are a few other quests. There's an afterward and a few other things. I still have so much to do for you. Oh, you've claimed all the event rewards. There's no need to exchange pleasantries. It's rather pathetic. Yo, what's up, Farface? Pleasant conversation just to occupy silence. Oh, 
Oh, wait. You've literally done everything. You've done all the stuff. You got all the chests? Artie, did you get all the chests? I need to know. I have arrived. Welcome, heart case. Okay, the fighting stuff is different, though. Did you do all of the chests? No, you're not gonna take me to the secret room. You're not Artemis Dre, fart face. This area made me cry. It has... All of the adventures from 1.5 like, until now. Yeah. You did good. You did good. Two days later? Let's get you all finished up. Yeah, it references all of the previous events and it makes me so happy because, like, as stupid as it is, um, when I started playing Genshin back in 2020, I was, um, to be a little... It's been a while since our last adventure. Oh, Pinal wonders how many Durin is getting along. Um, I'll be a little vulnerable here. Um. Let's go to the Forest of Blessings and take a look. Yeah. At the time... I was homeless and um, didn't know if I was going to have somewhere to sleep at night for quite often in more COVID. I was 17. And I just had my phone and a computer where I could play Genshin. And that was basically all I did while I tried to attend school online, which was a mess because of COVID. And this game brings back so many memories for me because it was through a time in my life where I had to fight to live and survive. So why I love the game a lot, um, so yeah, um, I think that it's a silly game that just makes me really happy, and it got me through some of the toughest times of my life, so. Huh, too slow. Win. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah. Here's your two magic tonics. Oh, I thank you, young lady. And might I add that you're looking quite lovely. <laughs> but is still worried about Clee? <laughs> Relax. Albedo's with her. She'll be fine. Hi, Master Jean! What are you it, doing it did, here? yeah. It really did. Because uh, if uh, I hadn't found it, it is. probably wouldn't be here today. So. You must be the pleasant surprise that Miss Alice told us about. Greetings to you both. This is one place I didn't expect to run into you two. The locals here have been talking non-stop about you hate some game jam who saved the world. You it <laughs> Let me guess. You two have been up to your old tricks. Well, not just us. We only played a small part. You could say we I'm were RC. two members of the Heroes Adventure Team. Still sounds mighty impressive to me. As ever. Our honorary knight is making us proud wherever they roam. That's right. We received a letter of invitation from Miss Alice, proposing that we take Clee for a vacation in Fairyland when work dies down. I wasn't sure what she meant by Fairyland at first, but if my eyes are not deceiving me, she was being quite literal. Clee ran off excitedly as soon as we arrived. <sighs> I'm a little worried about her. 
but Albedo the fact that they brought like Albedo back to this event me. made me so happy. I hardly say no to such yeah, I coded this all by myself. Uh huh. So I yeah. took it upon <laughs> myself to bring Jean to the nearest tower. Hey, fart face, fine. if you coded it, can you fix um? Hey, can you fix some things for me? Drink, huh? I have two requests. <laughs> well, we are on. <laughs> You're right. I should. Oh wait, Kaya. What? Is... The house special, of course. Best way to get a taste of the local culture. <laughs> 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 Why are you I have a long list of requests, my good sir. Nothing. How about you hmm. Something tells me I need to tread carefully here. No. See. No, it's no. Got a lovely color, but how about the taste? <coughs> <laughs> I would like I crafting to be accessible in the menu. Asked. Let me collect my fucking daily party. commissions from my book. All right, please. Paimon. Well played. Well, I'm on God burn too, if it's any consolation. Oh, by the way, ah! we weren't the only ones who got involved. Get out of the band, band. Get she out. You're either. so mean to me. She was making a beeline. Bullying and you. harassment. I thought her. Oh, I've been bullying her. All right. Well, give her my regards. Thank you. And Quit following me. Quit following me. The structure of the tree houses here is nothing short of amazing. I have to write it down. I don't hey, care. Kale. <laughs> Kale. Oh, you scared me. Shut the fuck up, Nightbot. I'll call you. No, but Nightbot's a good oh, bot. We yeah, like what? Nightbot the here. Forest ranger? Always a forest ranger, huh? Over there, by the giant footprints. Have those mouses a. Oh, those? The local flying squirrels told me. Oh, that must have been supposedly. Have to really. Yep, you got it. Oh, all. Hmm. Now that you. Oh, no. They mentioned some stuff along the lines of. Pass. I only just got. Oh, thank goodness. Are you looking for. Yeah, he's in the way. Ugh. No, no, no. I've got the saber for next time. For now, I've got to make. Oh, there's no rush. Just take it slow and enjoy your. Oh, Mr. Kai. Well, right now he's at the. T <laughs> you make a good point. Shall we go pay a visit to the Metropole Traveler? Oh, right. By the way, something pretty interesting has been. Sounds good. We'll pass some time in our. Of course. See you later. The one thing that confuses me is the weird side quest they give you. Huh, too slow. What? Uh, are my eyes deceiving me? Have that it's that little no time on? I can't believe it. Yeah, a lot of hey, okay. Yeah. We heard you muttering from a long way away. Paimon's voice was so much better I in the start, and then they made her go higher pitched. Oh, it's you, the saviors of this world. Look. Look at this statue. What? Is it broken or something? Looks fine to Paimon. That's your map. I refuse to believe it. When she was younger. Oh, she can't hear you, can she? I swear you just got chills down my spine. Uh, either way, it's probably a lid. But how do you know it's a statue of her if you never saw her as a young woman? I did a quick scry when I came into this world, and when I saw the star's reflections, I was at a lot of projection of real world, or in layman's terms, uh, basically, the creator made this world inside a mere- Still sounds pretty impressive. The more I scryed, the more familiar everything looked. It's her work, there's no doubt about it. Even so- Honestly, if this, you really don't I like her voice, you could just her. turn off the dialogue, or just her. not she listen to her. dominion over the stars and the- Not that I'm surprised in the least, of course, it's certainly- Oh! You mean the one that caused all that to most people, except it is a- Oh, okay. One moment. Ah, uh, cool. 
want to come with me? I think I'll set this. What do you mean? We'll be off now. Treat. We should go back to the nicer Sophie. Yeah, I really do too. Or I really wish there was an option to choose P if Paimon speaks or not. Like, turn her voice off only. I want to hear the other characters. I just hate Paimon's voice. What I am seeing? Your eyes see true. Very well. Then, as sovereign ruler of the Imanakreish, I extend to you greetings, <laughs> O Night Dragon from the land of the Thousand Stars and his hat wearing servant. Who did you just call a servant? <laughs> I forgot this line existed. <laughs> Who did you just call a servant? <laughs> what main Fräulein means to say is, hello, it's a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you too. <laughs> but that guy's not my servant. He's my friend. <sighs> now you're over explaining. That guy, give me Durin. Now you at last. Oh, and fishes with the cue? <laughs> oh, greetings, Outlander, blessed by the Imanakreish. How honored you are to meet your Miss Honorary Knight, Paimon! <laughs> Albedo, my husband! Greetings. <laughs> you both look well. I didn't just bark at my husband. He's never in the event anymore! <laughs> my husband. Nobody clipped that. Having fun here? Yep, loads and loads of fun. There are so many cute animals and a magic train that was really long and a huge, huge castle and a queue lives there and everything. I've been taking Klee to see all the sights. It's been a very enriching experience. Alice's magic is truly outstanding. <laughs> Husband. No! 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 Don't do this to me, chat. You've been a good boy. Yeah, mom's amazing. Klee wants to build a great big house now, too. So? Mm -hmm. Our moms were friends, which makes you my big brother. Wow. Thank you, Klee. Can I go play with Klee, hat guy? Suit yourself. Albedo, Albedo, can I? Go on. Uh, just don't go too far away. I'll come pick you up later. Yay! Come on, Minnie Durin. Do you want to come? <laughs> your princess and accepts your invitation. What main Fräulein means to say is, perhaps... Hooray! Oh, me too! To return to our previous discussion, Mr. Hat Guy, you were telling me about a prophecy. I heard B talking to M. What she said was, "Since you're so precious, child." Uh, is she saying that Dragon Spine Durin will come back to life? I only heard it in a memory, so don't hold me to it. Understood. My recent observations at Dragonspine lend credence to this prophecy as well. Durin's heart has slowly but surely been growing in vitality. The process is extremely slow, but the trend is clear. Uh, what should we do? To start with, plan for every potential scenario. Including, of course, the worst case scenario. I am well aware of Durin's past, and I sincerely hope that things never escalate to that point. If the prophecy is true, and Durin's heart will one day beat again, I'd like to hope that whatever rises from the dead is no evil dragon, if you understand what I mean. Kind of? And so, when the time comes, Mr. Hat Guy, 
Will you and Simulanka's Durin be willing to lend us a hand in our hour of need? Huh? What's this got to do with me? You save the Durin of this world. If there is any meaning to be read into the actions of the three goddess, the fate of this reflected if Durin of Dragonspine will soon come back to life, we will need many Durin's help, as well as yours, given that you're f- Oh, well that's a nuisance. To be sure, it certainly won't be easy. Albedo, Albedo, there's a flying paper sh- Sure, uh, two seconds, I'll be right with you. Please give my suggestion some thought, Mr. Hat Guy. <sighs> Hat Guy, I'm back! Huh? <sighs> Nothing. Huh. Okay, then. All right, I'll be right there. Why would I be? Do I strike you as someone who cares about other people's issues? Why well, Mrs. Bird in front of me dies? Yes. <laughs> Quit trying to guess what I'm thinking. I'm leaving. The forest fairy hunt. I just realized there's a lot fewer people around the broken. Does this boat have a name? Huh? Mm hmm. Every They're usually symbolic. Mm. Hmm. Let's go with the Durin. Huh? Oh, you mean to wish Mini Durin a pure princess and approves? Let the the Durin. <laughs> Let's call it Aww. that. Then. Thank you, Hat Guy. Also, go on. Remember how mom's friend said I should be able to leave this world? Well, huh? Uh, is is that a no? I don't think that's a great idea. If the people of Simulanka are allowed to go to Tibet, then what's the problem with I'm assuming I'll have to be your I I can protect myself. And I'll do what you say. I won't fly off on my own. I promise. Please, can I go? It'll be up to you to stick close. If Got it! I'll stick close! Why don't you take the Durin? Now you've given it a name, it'll... Are you leaving, Mini Durin? Okay. Though our time together has been as... What main Fräulein means is... Cool! Oh, I have so many... <sighs> Are you done yet? If you want to leave... Thank you, everyone! Thank you so much! Next time, it will be my... Marcy, what? What? God, I don't want to do this. I really don't. I hated this quest. It makes no sense why it's included. When I mean this quest makes no sense, there's no audio dialogue. Kave all hate film and a few others are included in it. Hello, Raylan. Yes, I am. I'm fixing a account today. I appreciate your help. Thank you. Darling. I'm currently helping my friend first, but I'm more than willing to help other people. Absolutely.
spent like Fado's on his here and like the entire this entire quest line makes no sense for what they did. It, it has like no sense, like whatsoever. It's literally the weirdest fucking quest line I've seen. Basically, the gist of this quest, and I'm not this is not like there's no thing. I'll, um, Kave gets fucking drunk and tired and circles a name in a book that everyone starts reading, and then Tignari does some more, and then Alhaitha does some more, and then they start, like, making it like it's a hidden thing, like, and there's no actual, like, treasure, and it's so stupid. It is the most weirdest side quest they could have made as an event quest. And I'm only doing it because it gives you, like, primos. But that's pretty much it. It is so stupid. It is literally because Kave got drunk, circled the name in a book, and Alhaitha was like, yeah, let me just circle the name of this book. And then Chignari does it, and then Saito does it, and then Dia does it, and all these other idiots do it. And then they're just like, oh yeah, there's a treasure. No, there fucking isn't. Honestly, no. I hate this quest so much. Artie, you can do this later today. I'm not doing it. It's so dumb. It's so fucking stupid. I hate it so much. That's funny, Kova. Right, but I hate it that much that you can have fun with it. It took 30 minutes of my life. Following me. Oh, I hated this quest line too, it sucked. My fucking Marthy! Get the fuck out of my floor! Oh,
course he got into, into her calming medication for the vet. So she's probably gonna be drunk. Where's the oculi? I'm confused. Did that really just give me a, a regular chest for that? Oh, that pissed me off. Oh, Alright, I need a Dendro character. I'm quite flattered. It's all you were needed for. Better be important. Quest is done after this, I believe.
Wong, thank you so much for the follow. What's going on? So, um, this old guy up here is, like, here, I think, tomorrow, like, in real time. If I recall correctly, and that's, like, how you finish off the achievement. I'm surprised that wasn't an achieve uh, thing for Sumero. This poor girl. I keep. 
keep forgetting you haven't done bedtime story yet. You should really do bedtime story. Adventure time. That's another done. God, you haven't done anything in Superhero Arty, please. Do your entire account a favor. Where is your traveler? This she sucks ass. All right. Oh. Uh, that's fine for now. We'll figure her out in a little bit. She's not important though, really. She's good to have, but There's no need to. Okay. 
those pleasant trees. Is this? Oh, you started Sino's story quest, didn't you? I'd say we're right about on ski. Traveler, Hylon, let's go fishing together. You got it. Dinner's on us tonight. <laughs> I hope I can contribute too. The other forest watchers gave me some fishing tips a little while ago. I saw some very appetizing mushrooms in the area, so I gathered a Wow, camping with a forest watcher is the way to go! They think of everything! And even if they don't, they can improvise! This is true. I don't think I've ever had a single rough day in this forest. So? Hmm. Well, there's been some high points and low points, but we've had some unforgettable experiences along the way. I see. Well, in that case, you should try a Valberry. I bought some from the market this morning. A valuable suggestion. <laughs> Just don't bury your feelings using food. Uh, all I wanted was to recommend something bittersweet. Oh, I have a sudden craving for fruit tea. I'm gonna go fetch some stuff. Bye! Sure made a run for it. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about this one. <laughs> she Unbelievable. She made a run for it. Hmm. So Kale chose the path of tactical retreat. Could it be she foresaw what shall soon come to pass? My dear friend, you know what I am about to say. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. A kindred spirit. Excellent, a, a kindred spirit. When a duel is <laughs> <laughs> but it looks like we'll get told off if we start playing now. <laughs> Let's enjoy the nature for a while longer. <laughs> look, look at the face. He's like, excuse me, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'll reel it in. Firewood, spices, snacks, and drinks. Everything's ready. Once Kale gets back, we can light up the fire and start grilling. There are three tents. Which one do you two want to take? Hmm. How about the one on the left? Well, Kaimon just thinks the ambiance here is a little... Hmm. True. But it's also... Hmm. Well, that's no good. <laughs> take my way. Anyone would think you were sealing the gates to King Deshret's mausoleum. Excellent. Then this tent will be an impenetrable fortress. <laughs> Ready for the barbecue? Always. Oh, it smells so good. My mind swooning. Someone sure is desperate to eat. Hmm. I think it's time to add the seasoning. Wait, what? This is a tank. If it works for steak. Medium well for me. Okay, these are about ready now then. It'll be a few more minutes for anyone. Oh, that was so delicious. Stop making me if hungry, I'm game. I'm already hungry enough. She'd eat three more skewers. 
I ate a lot too. <sighs> Here comes the food coma. If you're tired, then go rest. You must be getting sleepy too, Paimon. Uh, why don't you guys head to your tents? Sino and I will clean up. Tonight I show you mercy. Our sacred duel will take place another day. <sighs> Good night. <sighs> Paimon's struggling to keep her eyes open. Oh, don't forget this. The staff of the Scarlet Sands. <laughs> Bro just goes, ha ha! My oar! <laughs> Wait, you were actually being serious about that? It's a very powerful weapon. Try it. Paimon can't even lift that thing. Fair enough. You sure? Yeah, Paimon's sure. We'll be fine. And even if we do... Of course, guys, guys, we've upgraded. Chat, we have upgraded from the one star sword to a two star sword. Oh my god, chat, we've upgraded. We're going places. <laughs> that reminds me of a parting king of invocation. I oh, I'll tell you about it tomorrow. But right now. They should all be here. Kave! Uh, Traveler? Paimon? Are you in there? Look at this. What the? What's this sword doing here? Is it supposed to keep out intruders? Evidently. <laughs> uh, uh, what? Who is it? Oh, what time do you... <gasps> Paimon's gonna take out the sword! Yeah! Come. Sorry to wake you up at this hour of the night, but we've got a situation on our hands. Let's get dressed and talk about it outside. Something has come up, and since it pertains to Cyrus and Sino, I deemed it essential to inform you all. Whoa, whoa, back up. Uh, let's start from the beginning. Yeah, honestly, such a mood. Let me go back to bed. Let the wine cups go. Ah, there they are. I'll have a cup too. Can you see if the cookies are still on the table? They are. And so are the fruits. Hmm. Oh, this is so bland. I should have gotten a few bottles of what sign- Do tell. Oh, right, I forgot to mention. So, I ran into Cyrus yesterday evening when I went to the tavern to pick up some things. He was hosting a dinner for Sino, Tainari, Kale, and the Traveler and Paimon. Anyway, they got a bottle of Lombard's new vintage for the table. At least, I think that's what it was. It looked pretty good. Hmm. Sounds like they're all tangled up in this. You know what it's about, right? Sixteen-year-old kid tried to extort Cyrus. He was asking for ten million mora. I heard some people talking about it on the streets, yes. Didn't take them long to catch the culprit. The sages are probably dealing with the case by now. <sighs> I wonder what Sir Nephis and the others will make of it. Oh, Cyrus showed me the extortion letter, too. Uh, give me a sec, I'll sketch it out for you. The, the, the fact that he has, like, a fucking photographic memory is so funny. Okay, done. Take a look. You see what I mean? I don't think I've ever seen writing paper like this. Hmm. Interesting. What? Take this, for instance. Looks like an outline of a spire, similar to the kind found on some ancient palaces. 
and the yes, crisscrossing yes. and mirroring here. I reckon it bears a striking resemblance to an ancient emblem. Whose emblem is it? It's the emblem of the Temple of Silence. After discussing it with each other, we both agreed that something didn't feel right. This was a long way to come from the city. Alhatham figured you were probably with Tainari, so then, just as we were heading off to the campsite, we ran into Sino. Uh, hold on, so what's the deal with that emblem you- Something's up, huh? Give me a second. Let me get Kale. So you've never heard of the Temple of Silence? Hmm. These days, you can find a Temple of Silence office in the Academia. Theoretically, it's responsible for the cut. At least, that's what they tell the outside world. Historically speaking, the original Temple of Silence is said to have been established by Hermenudis, one of the... By contrast, none of the Academia Temple's current members are from the desert region, nor do they use any symbols connected with the desert folk. So the Temple of Silence at the Academia is just a fake? Wow. It's possible. The real question is, why? My guess is, they're covering something up. So, how do you know all this? So Did you forget? He did a stint as acting Grand Sage, and kept the pay raise even after he resigned. Oh, yeah! If you're asking me whether I familiarized myself with the documentation in my office, I would respond that that's a perfectly normal part of any job. So much about this doesn't make sense. Why did the emblem of the students only 16? And doesn't... You said you ran into Sino. Yep. He ran off. Given that Cyrus is involved, he's... Hmm, still... Hmm. If the Academia's Temple of Silence really does exist just to cover up the truth, we should pay a visit to the Academia. Yes. As the Sage of Amorta, my master ought to know the truth about their office. You can... If this situation is connected to the real Temple of Silence... Kale, could I trouble you to send a message to the Core of Thirty? Traveler, Paimon, you... Sounds like a plan. Yay. Cyrus has been living in the city lately. He rented a place near the... Um, so it has been four hours and... I'm kind of getting hungry, so I am going to say that I'm going to collect this reputation and probably end stream here. I am going to get you close to the... I've also lowered your world level, so it's a little bit easier to fight things. That being said, let's call it a night, yeah? We didn't do as much grinding as I would have liked to, but we did get a decent amount done, which is good. Let's switch over to ending. Thank you guys so much for coming. I had a blast. Um, Artie, I'll send you a message on Discord with, with uh, from some stuff if you can get that done tonight. That would be great. Um, let's raid someone. Oh, I know exactly. No, no, I don't want to do that, Twitch. Anyways, see you guys on Thursday. Bye.